the best you can be. And I just want to thank, I, I had the opportunity to work with some great people in this school and the school district that they were all for kids. And I love Lovelock. And uh, I put my heart out there to my dad. It tears me up. How we doing? I'm good. Tell me about Stan. Stan is one of the best mentors I could ever ask for. He taught me everything I know about coaching. This gym should be named after him. Rightfully so. Let's go love him, baby. Always with me. I want to congratulate Stan McCoy for having this gym named after him. It is a well-deserved honor. Um, in my 20 years of teaching in Loveland, 17 years have been with him, and those were the best teaching years of my life. Um, he is dedicated to these kids. He put everything out there for the kids, whether he had them in gym class or whether he coached them. And he is Loveland true and true, and he's very Stan, I really don't have any questions for you. I just wanted to get your reaction. You, uh, it's yeah. unbelievable. What a great honor. And to have uh, my dad's middle school gym named after my father and then walk down the hallway and I'm, it's just unreal. Uh, doing something, getting an award for doing something you love to do. You know, work with kids. The teachers I work with were tremendous. They were all, were all the same boat trying to get the best out of kids. And I do miss that. I miss the, uh, interact, interacting with the uh, kids and making them try to be the best they can. That's very important. Because we all make mistakes. We make them every day. We just got to learn from them. But I'm really just uh, really feel honored. And you, have, you say something that I've heard you say quite often over the years about your expectations or... or Oh yeah, I, I expect people to hustle and do the best they can at all times. I always told the, the teams I taught, I said, you look in the mirror and you can't lie to yourself. So you know if you gave your best, and if you gave your best, you don't, you don't lose. You might get outscored, but you don't lose. And I think that's very important. I think that not just for sports, but for everything. You know, because you're going to have ups and downs, but you got to get up and do the best you can. And keep on fighting. Love and love on Tigers.